the second race here from Newcastle is the rehearsal listed handicap chase. Just six runners to go over three miles. Number one is Acasta Malbis, the 13 to 8 favourite. Number two is Twisted Row for Leon Ram Lensberg. Armageddon for Martin Needham is three. What a sunrise for Craig Beckwith is four. Lawn tennis for Pontypool Racing is five. And Penny Arcade for Alex Cherry is number six. It's a small little field to go around three miles here. At Newcastle in the mud. Trans raised a weight. It is the top weight, Acasta Malbis. Darren Thompson is going to lead this, although reluctantly. And the first it's a big old jump at it. The one that made a bit of a mistake was Twisted Road. But they've all managed to stay on their feet going over the first. The 19 they'll have to take here. Small ditch. And it skips over that a little bit better. So it is Acasta Malbis that leads us. By just a length or so from Armageddon and Penny Arcade together. In between those horses is Water Sunrise. The crowd against the fence, Lawn Tennis. Just dancing around at the rear is Twisted Road. As we go over the third, this time uh, pecked on landing is Penny Arcade for Alex Cherry and just shuffles towards the rear. There's nothing in it. So they go through the first half mile. So it's Acaster Malvis leads them over the fourth. Another poor jump at the rear by Penny Arcade. Need to sharpen his jumping and we're just losing shot of him out of the camera now. It's Acaster Malvis reluctantly leading. So the fifth gives it plenty of air. Now Armageddon to just almost draw alongside. Almost in single file now, so it's Acasta Malbis. It's first, then you go Armageddon and what a sunrise. Followed through by Lawn Tennis and Twisted Road. Just a couple of lengths behind those is Penny Arcade. So Acasta Malbis still leads us. Armageddon in second, what a sunrise is third, Lawn Tennis is fourth. Over a small ditch again. Much better jump at the rear this time by Penny Arcade. Need to be a bit of a mud lover here today. Heavy conditions. We have the seventh. Seen in the previous. Josh Southern picking up the fighting fifth. Now the eighth. So Armageddon draws alongside Acaster Malbis, Acaster Malbis now. Share of first and second, and they've got about a three length advantage now from Twisted Road and what a sunrise. They we'll skip over that one. Lawn Tennis the Grey, Penny Arcade. If we go past the grandstand. People do, there's a finishing post. It's Acaster Malbis that still leads us. By a length now to Armageddon, and a couple away from Twisted Road and what a sunrise on the inside. Gray, and tennis, and a little bit of room. Any arcade keeping him locked in there. And Castor Malvis still leads. Got a three length advantage now. His arm again drops back to join Twisted Road. Any arcade, long tennis, and what a sunrise. One and a half left to go. Malbis comes down to the next, takes a little hold again. Not too soon, steadies himself well. A bit over that far, Armageddon, and a bit of a mistake. Shuffles back, pushes what a sunrise out wide. So with a mile and a quarter to run there, Castor Malbis. Still being restrained. About three lengths from Twisted Road has moved into second on his own now. And wider, Penny Arcade. Armageddon and Lawn Tennis. Sunrise for Craig Beckwith at the rear at the moment. But it's Acasta Malvis still leading. Been there since the beginning. Top weight. It's by about three now to Twisted Road. And again, he's moved into third. And the arcade's still out wide. Get over the 11th. It's a bit late to jump and a mile to travel. It's Acasta Malvis still. Just by two now. It's Twisted Road closes the gap. In the ditch. So I jump at the rear by Water Sunrise. Pretty sedate pace this for a three miler. It's Acaster Malvis that's still holding them all off. He's got a three length advantage from Twisted Road that's just been bustled along a little bit. Oh, on a poor mistake at the rear by Water Sunrise. Down, lucky for Craig Beckwith. 
Wimbledon has also got court for a lot of its home now is Lawn Tennis the Grey. So Pacaster Malvis takes the 14th, joined by Penny, Card Penny Arcade on his outside. And it's Penny Arcade that tries to nose in front, but Acaster Malvis fights back. So we're coming down to the final five furlongs. Acaster Malvis from Penny Arcade on his outside. They go over the 15th wall together. Twisted Rover's a little bit slow over that one. So it's Acaster Malvis by length to Penny Arcade. Armageddon. Twisted Row running on really well now is Lawn Tennis. But we've got to catch this leader as we come down to the final half mile. And it's Acaster Malvis swinging left handed to line up for the judge. Acaster Malvis from Penny Arcade. Not running on Armageddon. We're trying to make up the ground is Lawn Tennis. Trying to push through his twisted road, but they've still got to catch this leader as he takes the 16th four from home. And it's Acaster Malvis from Penny Arcade. Lawn Tennis on the outside. Twisted Road and Armageddon. Oh, and a lot of pressure now as Acaster Malvis has still got the lead as we come down to the final two. Acaster Malvis takes the 17th well from Lawn Tennis on his outside. Armageddon trying to make on the run. Here comes Twisted Road and Lawn Tennis takes it up from their long time leader. Acaster Malvis inside the furlong and a half. Lawn Tennis takes the penultimate well from Armageddon fighting back through his Twisted Road but it's Lawn Tennis that's stolen the lead here with a furlong to go. But here comes Twisted Road and it's Twisted Road on the inside. Lawn Tennis fighting back. They go the last together. And it's Lawn Tennis but being held off by, by Twisted Road. And it's Twisted Road has got a little bit left coming uphill now here at Newcastle in the mud. It's Twisted Road for Leon Ram Rensburg. Let's take this from Long Tennis in second. Armageddon was third. I think Acaster Malvis hang on for fourth. And little old Penny Arcade was fifth. So bided his time there well. Van Rensburg takes the rehearsal listed handicap on Twisted Road from Long Tennis in second. Of Pontypool Racing. Third was Armageddon for Martin Leader. Unlucky for Acaster Malvis, our long time leader, was fourth for Darren Thompson. And Penny Arcade for Alex Cherry got up for fifth.